All to our live coverage of the ongoing group stage here, the tournament making steady progress towards its knockout phase. We'll be ready to go once the final checks are carried out. We have a hugely expectant crowd here. We just hope that the game lives up to the atmosphere. is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages one of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world Which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Mauro Icardi. He's going to be a, a big threat up front, Peter. And for me, it's his positioning that makes him the player he is. He just seems to always be able to find that extra half a yard. And he times his runs to absolute perfection. It just all seems completely instinctive. He makes it look so easy. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. So off we go then. Ihan. Delict. Coman. He's got away. Ihan attempts a clearance. Save, he got a decent fist on that. Has a hit! Oh, that is rather wayward. Look, it, it was achievable, Peter, but it needed his best. Torreira. Torreira gets it out to the wing. And the shot! Oh, denied brilliantly! Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. They've played it short. Good challenge, he just stood firm. It's a loose ball. Torreira trying to get there. Bayern Munich get it back again. And here's Mauro Icardi. It's... Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Here's the through ball. It's a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Torreira. Riccardi spreads it towards the left. He's making good use of his strength there. Just refuses to be out-muscled. Has a hit! And the keeper barely had to move. Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. Galatasaray have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Pavar, very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Oh, that's a waste.
Lays it out to the flank. He's got options out wide. He's had a go! Forward it goes. The referee's awarded a free kick. It's Muller! It's off target and by quite a way. Cooks through there. And helps available out wide. Chance! He's left his man. Whistle's gone, and the referee has given a penalty. And that really is the last thing they wanted to do. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal there. with certainty. Well, the keeper probably felt he could read that, but he's guessed completely wrongly. He's gone to the other side. Galatasaray put themselves into the lead. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Now it's Icardi. Icardi plays it out to the wing. De Ligt does well to read it and intercepts. It's come loose. Icardi gets it back. Not the worst cross in the world, but still room for improvement. Muller. Torreira. Out to the right. Bayern Munich are trailing here with the first half almost done. Great challenge. Time to perfection. Kimmich. it long there really wasn't very much in that not far away from being a telling final ball Galatasaray just had to make the ball stick but came up short battles to win it back oh, the defense got the better of him this time but I'm sure he'll go again looking cross field changing the point of attack to get it forward quickly. Played out to the right. Cuts it out. Loose ball. Who's going to get that? And it's the whistle for half-time. So there you have it. Close sport half of football. But it still had its moments. It ultimately produced just one goal. More than decent game up to now.
is the start of the second half. Bayern Munich don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in the second half. They can't hold back, though. Just brushed off the ball there. Pavard. Pavard with the crossfield ball. Torreira. Well, that's where he wants it. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Gnabry. He's made sure that that won't get through. Torreira. Ihan drives it forward. Gnabry. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. And here's Mauro Icardi. Mauro Icardi really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. And here's Kane. Koeman. Oh, sweet feet. Plenty waiting in the middle. Koeman with the delivery. And it's hoisted clear. Knocks it away. Bayern Munich are definitely going about this the right way. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. work on the right flank now what's next it's a fabulous position he's had a shot finds himself eased off the ball tries to switch the play ah oh, he's given it away Hoists it forward. Out to the left it goes. And again, they run up against stubborn defending. It tries a shot! Kimmich. A mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. Coleman tries running with the ball at his feet, and it's got through. Gnabry, and the finish! He scored! Just so calm under pressure. Muller really showed good strength there, held his man off, didn't let himself get bullied, and got his effort away. Maintained control. changes here from both sides in fact yeah it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off his energy levels began to to sag and he was never going to last until the final whistle Bayern Munich we're at the equalizer and we're all square well that goal just serves to give them the momentum and psychological edge now at this stage but for me they've got to chase a winner Galatasaray showing a good level of intensity at this stage they're calling on all their resources now Aimed in towards the centre. Galatasaray merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. 
right through the middle. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. And it's Canabry. It's a good foot in there. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Yep, it's a corner. Galatasaray making another change here. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Just deflected over the goal line for a corner. Galatasaray making consecutive changes here. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so... It's no surprise. And that will be the final act. Passion and panache and perseverance, and in the end, parity. A really good game to watch. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? A rather flat performance for me when we expected something a lot stronger. I think they thought the win would just come to them, and it didn't.